Hello, this is Cindy. Welcome to my channel and to Walk Through Wednesday with my latest journal that will be for sale. This is a travel journal. It is held together with uh, a, this is a sari silk tie. It says live every moment on the front of it with a couple of maps. There are some charms along the side. There's some buttons. There's a suitcase. There's an I Ching and a word that says believe. Opening it up, there's a little hand colored piece here. And then a very cool map. It, a history of maps right here. Out of an atlas, a couple of small pieces here. Here we have just uh, a couple of paint chips. In here there are a couple more places to write. On the back there's another spot to write in. That goes into there. And then there's another piece back here, another journal card back there. So there are lots of little tucks in that one. If you watched my video on what to do with these white spaces, you have seen some of these pieces before. As you watched me figure out how to cover up some of these white pieces down here. But as you can see, lots of room for journaling, lots of room for sketching or drawing or hiding little pieces. There are places to put photographs. And in fact, this was from a photograph piece that I covered. There's another card and then I love this piece. This was a jelly print that I did and I was using gold and you can write on the back of it. So there are a couple of little pieces there to use. Here is, there are a couple more, there's again, I, a lot of these are in here. I liked the railway because one of the things I wanted to do was show a lot of different methods of transportation. There's a lot of different ways to go around the world. Cool set of suitcases. This is a removable waterfall. You could take it out, write in it, write on it, turn it over, write on it, put it back in when you're done. A nice belly band with a big piece of writing paper. Like I said, a lot, lot, lot of places to write here. Keep track of all your journeys. A couple of big pockets here in the middle with some big tags. Again, some more of these. And I, I had a couple of these left over, so I just threw those in there as well. Just some little strips actually fairly long strips that you could use elsewhere. And then this was fun. So this is a, the, at the bottom of a paper bag. It says, please recycle this bag. So I did. And then in here are a lot of little uh, stickers. And you can use them wherever you want in here. Just use them up. A sideways waterfall, place to write, put some little pieces of writing. Another couple of journal cards here, and then a, a little coin envelope with a ship on it, because, you know, you have trains, you have ships, and then a couple of little tags inside there. I'll put that back here. Um, this was one made by a friend of mine and has some writing paper inside of it. It does not mean get lost. It says, let's go get lost. And a friend of mine made the clusters. We did a cluster exchange. And so I put her cluster in there because he looks like he's all packed and ready to go. And then we have another ship on the other side because we're going to go by ship. We have our ticket. We've arrived. Bon voyage. We have some you might choose to go by hat air balloon. You've already seen airplanes in here. 
So there's lots and lots of little pieces. And these are uh, great for writing on. So there's another ship. Got your passport ready. Divide it up into lots of different places to write. A little bit of shadowing on there. Um, and then a little bag here with that's been folded up and there's a tuck here and there's tucks here so there's more places to write more tickets and you can write all over the front of these so the bags have stuff on it but you can write all over the front of those some postage stamps from all around the world time for an adventure and there's a nice big tag inside here to write on and it says make today an adventure come on it's a little hard to get in straight there we go. Another, the other half of the piece on the back. And again, a couple more of these. Great big journaling card. And we're at the end. So I didn't count how many pages. I should count how many pages because I don't remember. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 13, 14, I don't know if you want to count that as 1, 15, 16. So 16 times 4 is 32, 64 pages. This is a 64-page journal with lots of places to write and sketch and draw. It will be available on my coffee shop, and I will put the link for it down below. Till later, this is Cindy signing off.